Hey, Jabby. What's up? Have you ever watched the movie A History of Violence? I saw the sequel, the spiritual sequel, uh, Eastern Promises. From what I have heard, this may be inspired by... I saw the or... opening of History of Violence. It okay. was pretty wicked. Yeah. Okay, so this might be inspired by or an adaptation of A History of Violence. Okay. Something like that. Okay. So you may I did see... not. I did not glean that at all from the teaser of this. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Are you joking? Isn't this the chocolate one where he's like got the sword and it's chocolatey? Is that? Is oh that, yeah, 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 okay. yeah. That feels like a very different vibe from what I got. But anyway, cool. Mm -hmm. You got crap on your eye right here, so a little eyelash if you want to make a wish. Where? It's right there. Why don't you just grab it for me? Because hashtag me too. You still it's still there? If you would have just grabbed it for me. That's what I tell women all the time. What is going on, everybody? I'm Jabby Kowei, joined by Char Kirk. What's up? We're looking at the trailer to Leo. I'm laughing at Achara, not the trailer. Uh, not yet, anyway. And so this is starring Thalapathy Vijay, Sanjay Dutt, Trisha. Oh, Sanjay Dutt's just everywhere, huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, this is written and directed by Lokesh Kanagaraj, who also did... Kaithi and Vikram. Thanks so much for uh, joining us. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, bell icon, all notifications, pretty please. Vota this up. Uh, let YouTube know you're enjoying what you're watching. Here we go. Let's check this out. Serial killer, He's scary looking. He's notorious. Oh goodness. Appo, or tonichalan or police officer, singa mari vande and the serial killer. That's an interesting angle. Yeah. Police officer gunna reload pandra and the gap le. To and the police officer or a gun on kail. And you have a clean shot. Oh. Oh, wow. That's quite the set. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Dang. Oh my. Good. Seems like a different approach for him. Yeah. Cause it's like he's still a he's a badass. Oh, okay, we got the Mitchell loaded going on. He's t he's a badass, but it seems like he gets hurt more. Yeah. Yes. Oh what? Whoa. Oh. Oh my goodness. Like Ooh, Mortal Kombat. <laughs> ouch. <laughs> Dang, wow, what a shot. Oh, there's that chocolate again. Yeah. Leo that we don't on the solo. I love the Anirudh music, man. Rest in peace. Yeah, that, I would say that's loosely inspired yeah. by History of Violence, if anything. I mean, I don't even remember the plot at all of History of Violence. I just remember the opening, like, the first 20 minutes or so, and then I paused for some reason, and I never came back to it. I keep meaning to, and I just... The History of Violence is one of those things where the way it starts out is uncomfortably violent. Like, the name fits the film. Right. It's, it starts out in a barber shop and someone gets killed. That's all I remember. And it's brutal and ugly. And it's like, it's not meant to be pretty or glorified at all. Mm -hmm. This 
is on the opposite end of the spectrum. It's very wild and fantastical. There's lots of jumping around. And when I say fantastical, what I mean is you're seeing action that is leaving the realm of a grounded realism. Yes. You know what I yes. mean? Which is fine. I'm not criticizing that. It's just like, that's definitely not history of violence, which is... I don't care. <laughs> like, I'm just saying, like, that's yeah. such a weird thing. To I don't know. This is just, this is just, uh, you know, some info that I was shared that okay. I thought I would share with you in case you had seen that. But like, I couldn't, I'm not able to see any parallels, obviously, because I have not seen that movie. But I thought that this looked really cool, very stylish. A lot of the shots were like really creative. Well, the thing that drew me in was seeing Talapathy Vijay in a slightly different angle insofar as he's not just a pure badass that is untouchable. Like yeah. he definitely gets hurt um, while maintaining the uh, image that we've come to know about him. Yeah. You know, in terms of like fantastical martial arts fight scenes and stuff like that, he's still showing you all that, but he's just getting damaged along the way. And so ideally that is informing how he responds in the situation. Uh, it, it might inform the choreography in some way because like if he gets hurt, like he has to he has to move differently. You know what I mean? So I, what is the story here exactly? <laughs> okay, so you didn't get the story either. No. Like I got a lot of action and like yeah. explosions and violence and there's like conflict there. I, I, I gleaned that much, well, but I, I didn't really understand the story. Yeah, I mean, maybe, I don't know. Maybe the story is that there is a serial killer and some people are after him. Like that whole, I guess, prologue in the beginning. I don't know if that's the story, but I do get the sense that uh, Leo, Talapathy Vijay's character, you know, he's a he's a dad. He's got a family. On some level, I'm sure he's going to have to protect his family. Sanjay Dutt is employing the uh, he's 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 being employed as a similar character to his guy and his character in KGF. Yeah, Chapter Two. I mean, not mad at it. Yeah, I yeah. mean, he's, I guess that's he's good at that. He is good at that, yeah. you know. And uh, you know, I'm happy to see him in more stuff. Yeah, especially in these types of roles which you know he does so well these menacing powerful kind of villainous roles yeah i just i wish that um i understand the excitement that the audience has for this mm -hmm. and i respect that completely but when you said history of violence i did get excited at the notion that this would be a different approach entirely when you mentioned that at the beginning i was like i really don't think that this is the direction that's going and it wasn't um, but it did have me excited for a fleeting moment that maybe they would take the quieter approach, you know, because you even have in the song, Leo, he's a badass. I'm like, all right. So <laughs> this is the ride we're in for, right? As opposed to like, you know, when you're watching A History of Violence or Eastern Promises, there's none of that. There's no lyrical music at all. It's all quiet instrumental to support the story. This is still you know? Indian cinema. Come on now. There's plenty of Indian films that do what I'm talking about. No, I it's know. Just, it's just not this. But it, the, of yeah. course, like this yeah. is this is gonna be a blockbuster. This, this is more of a commercial. Uh, um, what do you call it? This is more of a commercial film than a a quieter, um, slow burn, scary, uh, dramatic film. Sure. Yeah. But it's still uber violent, right? I. Yeah, sure. Yeah, Isn't it? I, I'm not Ooh, criticizing the think? movie. I'm just saying how y you set me up, and I was like, oh, that would have been cool. Oh, should I have told you that after the fact? No, it's fine. Talapathy Vijay, I think that the look here is also interesting for him. You know? I like it. I can't recall a time when I've seen him in a film and he's had that prominent salt and pepper in his beard. I feel like we've seen it a little bit before, Maybe. but not, not to this degree. No, and so, and also seeing, I guess, more of a gray Sanjay Dutt as well. Like, mm. I like that because I feel like a lot of the time, especially in the South Indian movies, you know, we know that our heroes are older guys, right? Like sure. Rajnikanth or, or anyone kind of in that age bracket, but everyone's always just kind of done up so that they are not really showing their age that much. And so I know that Talapathy Vijay is not, he's not old, do you know what I mean? But I like that kind of, uh, a little bit of that age coming through, that gravitas, you know? It, in a way, in the midst of all of this craziness, in a way by having these characters look just more realistic in a way, 
it grounds it a little bit more for okay. me, even though everything so is just kind of like going if, off if, the wall. If Lokesh Kana Garage is watching, okay, and I understand that maybe this is not possible. After this movie breaks records at the box office and is a massive success, maybe, <laughs> maybe do an adaptation of Nobody and keep it like grounded. And he's old, whoever you're... If it's if it's Thalapathy Vijay or whoever, he's too young. He's for he's, he's older. No, he can older, right? Or can play older. Yeah. And you have the you have that inform the fight scenes. Like he's not he can't move as well as he did when he was twenty, and that's interesting. How does that inform the fight? Sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. Don't have him flying around and stuff like that. Have him fighting for his life. <laughs> you know, <laughs> nobody. Watch. I I hope I hope to see Lokesh Kana Garage try something like that because it's like this is obviously in his wheelhouse. This is something he yeah, knows how to do. Very much so. You know, very stylistic. Very cool yeah, looking. Let's, yeah. Let's depart from that and go grounded and see what happens. I'm just you know throwing that out there. I'm just crossing my fingers and hoping. Hoping. Lokesh Kana Garage, meanwhile, is like counting his stacks of money yeah. and it's like. Javi, no. Yeah. <laughs> Why would I yeah. do that? Yeah. I'm just gonna do what I'm good at, which is clearly these like hyper stylized, yeah. awesome looking fight scenes. Well, that's the thing I have to understand also. It's like, while I hope for certain things, I understand at the same time that there are certain things that appeal to most people who are going to the movies. Exactly. Right? This and, does. And so it's, it's one of those things where I wonder if for the for the filmmakers if they're almost a little bit boxed in to certain types of films, you know, sure. like you because like there's only so many people who can be Raj and DK is basically what I'm saying. You know what I mean? Right. If you feel so inclined to change it up and do something different, then I don't. Sure, I don't know if they're, what I'm what I'm trying to acknowledge is the possibility that they can't or yeah. that. Yeah. I mean, but. On the other hand, when you have stacks of money <laughs> and you feel like, hey, I could do that artistic thing and, sure. and not worry about blowing my, my cash, yeah. then. When you when you try to go different, sometimes you end up with SRK and a monkey, you know? <laughs> you got to be careful. Yeah, but the, the look at him now. Right, he had to go back to the thing he was doing before, <laughs> but bigger, and now he's just, you know, that's, that's all I'm saying. Uh, anyways, you guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I'm Jabby Koi. This is Achara Cook. Peace out.